What up, everybody? It's Hancock. Welcome back to the Hancock Show. Now, don't be acting all crazy all of a sudden. Now, I know I look different to y'all. All right, this is my new look. This is for for the videos and stuff that I be in. All right, so you don't be tripping. Don't be tripping. All right, I'm just showing y'all I look a little different. Don't worry, I'm going to change back in my regular clothes. All right, let me go change my regular clothes, y'all. Y'all don't know how to deal with change, and that's what we're going to be talking about. All right? All right, now, here we go. All right, I'm back. Now, before we get all started, the reason why I was showing y'all that, like, uh, you know, this is, since I want, I want, you know, I love y'all, man. I love y'all, my fans, man. You know I do, man. So, um, we got some, some sculptures going on now, man. So, if you're interested in something like that, you got to hit us up for real, man. He's making, they making everything. They made me. I mean, that, that was the first standard of me right there. They might make a better me. They got Batman and Robin back there. That's all right. I like that stuff right there, man. I'm about to make me another one in this suit. But, you know, I'll still be hooking it up with y'all with like this. You know, I, can, I can't go. You know, I, I stay original. All right. So let's, let's talk about what we're going to talk about. All right. Now, the superhero movies, they took a break for a while, you know. And now they call coming back. But it's something I'm starting to notice. And I know y'all notice this too. But there's a lot of guys... It's like a lot of guys playing a bunch of different superheroes. And it's just one guy. Now, why are y'all doing that? Now, for me, when I see a superhero, somebody playing a superhero, I think of him as that, that's of how that superhero look. I mean, everybody still think Superman looks like Christopher Reeves. And like, in my opinion, shoot, uh, what's his name? Uh, Tobey Maguire, he looked he look like Spider-Man to me now. I'm like, I think if Spider-Man was a real person, that's how he looked. But suddenly, now he's changing it around. Now this other dude, that dude from the social network, he gonna be, he gonna be Spider-Man, but I'm a little skeptical about that, but, you know, they always changing people up. You know, Batman is like, oh my goodness, like 500 men to play him. And, uh, and then it was, you know, Superman had quite a few people, mainly from the TV show and stuff. So, but now we got people who are going to try to play all these heroes, try to take over, the, try to take over the world. For example, Ryan Reynolds. How you going to be Deadpool and Green Lantern? Make up your mind. Did y'all know he was supposed to be the Flash too? I mean, what if he decided to be the Flash? I mean, you gonna be, and then they're gonna put a Flash and Green Lantern movie. How you would do that, Ryan Reynolds? You're gonna be like, "Hi, I'm Green Lantern." No, I'm the Flash. No, I'm Green. I'm Green Lantern. No, no, I'm the Flash. Like Flash ain't that fast. Come on now. Then you got like Nicolas Cage, who wants to play every single hero in the book. Dude, you can't play them all. You don't even look like a superhero. Y'all remember when they was gonna get him to play Superman? Come on now. They had him as Ghost Rider. I mean, a lot of people didn't like that because of him. I mean, like, come on now. But now, now hold on now. But Kick Ass, man, he did that. He did his thing in Kick Ass. Now I liked him in that. That's what he needs to stay as 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 Big Daddy, man. But too bad he got killed. I I, I spoiled the movie, y'all. Uh, but y'all should have read it. Y'all should have saw it by now. But yeah, he gets killed. So anywho, yeah. And then like you got the people who do the voices of superheroes for cartoons like my main man neil patrick harris man that dude plays everybody's voice man have you seen this dude plays everybody's voice he was he was spider-man he was nightwing he played a villain he played two, a couple of villains i think with batman i mean and he's dr horrible man that's a that was a funny blog yeah, i like that dr horrible that dude loves he, he likes comic books then you got like michael rosenbaum that dude that played that, that played Lex Luthor in, in Smallville, man. He's also the Flash on on Justice League Unlimited. You know, it was something else he played. I don't remember right now. And then, but you know, villains do doing the same thing, man. Some guys don't know how to play anything else but a super villain for everything. Like James, uh, um, this dude. Yeah, that dude that played Spike and uh, uh, Buffy. Yeah, this dude played. Brainiac in Smallville, he played Lex Luthor on that Superman Doomsday uh, movie, he played, he played Piccolo, man, he played Piccolo, this dude, he, he, he's always playing somebody bad guy, I mean, do something else, and then, oh man, and then they got uh, No Ordinary Family, y'all, y'all should check that out, that's, that's my new heroes, because heroes got stupid and got canceled, but, oh well, heroes, now we got No Ordinary Family, that, that's, it's, it reminds me a lot of Fantastic Four and I wonder why because the thing and the father are the same guy with the exact same powers it's like you can't you don't know how to play anything else Michael Chiklis you don't know how to play anybody else 
You gotta play the strong guy that goes with his family that goes with a family to a trip and then they get magical powers and I mean superpowers and then he's super strong. It both times it happened to you twice. And speaking of Fantastic Four, I mean like they got I mean, Chris Evans, dude. Oh, man, Chris Evans. He's trying to play everybody that's in a comic book. This dude is Captain America now. I'm looking forward to it, but you were Human Torch. Human Torch and Captain America, man? Come on now. And then you was in... Oh, man, he was in The Losers. That was another uh, That was another movie, uh, another comic book movie. I'm like, dude, you're trying to be everybody, man. And he was in, um, what's the name? Scott Pilgrim. Yeah, he was a, that was another comic book movie. Him and Brandon Roth was in that. And, and that is, hey, you got Captain America and Superman in that movie. That's, that's what I'm talking about there, man. So, anywho, I got somebody up here in the studio to talk to. The dude himself. Human Torch, how you doing, man? How you doing? Hey, I'm doing all right, man. I'm doing fine, Hancock. Hey, this is not the first time we worked together, remember? Hancock meets Fantastic Four. Oh, yeah! about that man yeah y'all need to check out that video man for real man. you did those day, man talk about your sister fine man oh yeah she's fine <laughs> oh man she sure is man she need to play it up the superhero for real but anyway man what is up with you trying to be in everybody movie well i'm fit i'm strong i can play anybody i want i'm just trying to get known you're trying to get your face in a comic book man why don't you just make up your own superhero play somebody else man just be your own be, be something that wasn't in the comic book that's not a bad idea, Hancock. I'll be right back. All right, all right. So, anywho, if y'all can think of any other people that play, uh, that always play superheroes or, or tight cast or whatever, just let me know, man. Uh, you know, put that in the comment box. I, I would like that. All right, I'm back. Man, what? Man, what? Who are you? What? Uh-uh. No, no, man. No. No. Uh-uh. You ain't, you ain't gonna be, you ain't playing that character. Why not? They're making a sequel. I heard. Yeah, Hancock Part 2 starring Chris Evans. How? Well, you just look different for this. Man, get, get your butt back, man. That's... All right, all right, so never mind about that then. All right, so, yeah, y'all make sure y'all send some comments about that. So, uh, stay tuned next episode of The Hancock Show where we're going to be talking about the worst of the worst. 2010 was a bad year for movies, and we're going to talk about it. All right? Oh, yeah, and... uh. Follow us on Twitter, man. Uh, it's uh, Josh Journal. Yeah, I mean, anything, anything Josh Journal or Prop Josh, that's us. The same thing, all right? So, yeah, go ahead and follow us there, man. We're going to keep you updated on what's coming up next and this and that. All right? So, holla, y'all. Holla!